I was asked about my teacher and how he operated his classroom. His job was on the line. So I realized my words would affect his future and his career. Hi, my name is Jessica Arcevala. I go to El Paso High. I run track and cross country, and I'm also a Girl Scout. Ethics to me is based on your upbringing, and it helps you distinguish between right and wrong. Ethics helps you also deal with other people, and I think that's one of the most important things is how you treat other people and how other people like see you. So this past school year, I took a challenging class with a challenging teacher. This teacher was known to have strong opinions on topics, and he would give those opinions if he was asked by students. So one day in class, a student asked if he would take the Holocaust class that was offered at my school. He responded with no, and then elaborated on his opinion. And with what he said, it was very shocking, but not much of a surprise coming from him. He said he would not take the class, and he also said that he did not agree with how celebrated the Holocaust was. And he said that if the people being oppressed had been of color, it wouldn't be so memorialized. Like, he's a great teacher. He knew what he was discussing in terms of math, but he had no business talking about the Holocaust. Yes, he was a math teacher talking about the Holocaust. So a series of follow-up questions came up, one being, a classmate that is actually Jewish. So she was very offended by what he was saying and how he was saying it. So eventually she took this discussion to her mother, who took it to the administrators at our school. He began to be investigated, so the rumors began to like soar. And I didn't believe any of them until I was called down to the principal's office. And I was asked questions about my teacher and how he operated his class. So. I was faced with the decision to either say exactly what happened or to just say not exact details. I knew that whatever I would say would affect my teacher and his career, so I knew I had to choose my words very carefully. I decided to tell the truth. I said that he operated his class a little differently than other teachers, but I was still learning and I still felt very prepared for the AP test at the end of the year. But he would often kind of sidetrack from material and talk about things that had nothing to do with our class. My teacher was put on suspension for five weeks, so we lost so much time and it was really bad because we were not learning anything. My teacher was affected, my classmates were affected, and my education was affected. I think he learned that he needs to adjust his words according to the audience, and I think now he knows the power of words and how one thing you say can have numerous effects on your life. I don't think I would have changed it if I could, but I can't help but wonder if using different words would have changed the outcome, if my teacher would have stayed for the rest of the year. I think I'll definitely carry this experience throughout the rest of my education and throughout life. Now I know how words can really affect life, honestly.